Hello everybody, welcome back to another episode of Boom Beach. So, uh, yes, after the last episode, uh, which was like a mega, mega upgrading episode, we shot up all the way to level 11, uh, we got quite a few battles done, and then at the end uh, we managed to visit this resource base here, and uh, pretty much get absolutely scummed by it. I mean, we took the sniper towers out and the machine gun just, I think, but uh, it was this thing at the back that really uh, got to us. But it was uh, our soldiers, I think, were dawdling about and things like that. So I uh, ended by upgrading the headquarters, which means now, instead of soldiers, uh, we can actually... Uh, can we? One second. I thought we had the... Uh... Ah, yes, right, okay. What we've got to do is change the troops. I was going to say, I'm sure we had the Zookas. Uh, so, yeah, you come here and you change troops. And now... We can get Zookas, so uh, that is the first job. We're going to uh, get the Zookas nice and settled in, and uh, that's going to take a good few minutes. It's going to take 16 minutes in all. Uh, so what I'm going to do in the meantime is go to a resource base, because um, we've got quite a lot of money, and uh, we actually need a lot of wood. So all these are available as extra pieces of wood for us to take. And uh, because these are resource bases, uh, they could get taken over at any time by people, so it's best idea to actually uh, get them all removed. Also, as well, we upgraded, so I'm going to also get another sniper tower down, uh, which will only take a few seconds, so we'll stick that there for now. And that is done, and we'll have to get that upgraded with the rest of them, but uh, eventually, and uh, yeah, we need a sculptor because we need to get some statues so we'll stick that right over there for now that's going to take 30 minutes as well and uh, that's taken a bit of wood down as well so that means we can go back to the resource base and uh, just collect all of these they're only uh, here one time to remove but like I said someone else could take over this resource base and uh, take all the wood down and it's uh, just a good easy extra way of getting wood so uh, we're going to take advantage of that now and uh, nick as much as we can I don't know if we, no, we can't take the thickets down yet but we can take some of the other ones down and that's a thicket, thicket grab that oh I ain't got enough right we've run out of money um, that's fine we can get some more money and come back with that so yes uh, like I said I'm going to uh, definitely go after that resource base there today but while I'm waiting for them um, while I'm waiting for them I'm also going to maybe upgrade the gunboat at some point as well when that sculpt is built yes I might do that because that will give us a bit more energy to uh, fire at that annoying thing right at the back where is it um, this thing if that gets hold of the zookas which it will which it will then the zookas do not have a lot of health at all you've got to keep them behind your heavies they're very powerful but they do not have a lot of health at all and uh, yeah, we could really do with another resource base. So, I will see you guys in a minute when these uh, Zookas have fully upgraded. Um, and this has been built. I'm going to upgrade the gumbo. And we'll probably take on... Uh, we'll test the Zookas out, I reckon, with uh, with one of these. And then we'll probably end up taking on the radar base afterwards. Uh, sorry, resource base afterwards. So, I'll see you guys in a second. Right, well here we are then, we have ourselves a Sculptor, so uh, let's have a look what we've got, we've got four green uh, and one red, so the life ones are the green, they're the ones that do um, things like um, you get extra production, so like bonus resource percentages and stuff like that, this is um, base defence, so uh, you've got things like, um, you know, just making your base tougher basically, uh, the magma's for the troops, so that'll be like 7% troop damage or troop defense and stuff like that and darker just like random things like uh, power, power powder which will come across at some point chance and stuff like that it's mainly the life you want um, but the idol will be like it's a 10 second build it's something like uh, I don't know something like 7% wood production and you got the guardians which are a bit more um, they are basically seven lots of seven uh, of these fragments um, so you need 49 of them in order to get the Guardian, and then the same with the Masterpiece. Guardians would be like, I don't know, 15% or something like that, wood production. And then you've got the Masterpiece, which will be about 30, I think. So at the minute, we can have three statues if we want. So we're going to have to collect the uh, crystals again. We've got loads of upgrades to do as well, now that we've uh, leveled up. I want to get the gunboat up slightly before the um, 
before the battle with the resource base. But we've got our Zookas and we're going to go and see how good they are right now. So let's go for a level 4 and see how easy it is to take this off. Oh my god, this is going to be really easy. Really, really easy. Okay, so uh, what we'll do here straight away is... Uh, yeah, we'll take out that guy first. With three shots. And then it'll just be a case of uh, taking on the sniper tower. Now... Yeah, I'm going to go straight in with the heavy here. I'm going to go on this side. I was going to go on that side, but while we're sodding about with all these barrels, um, that sniper's going to try and pick us off. So I'm going to put the heavies in first, and then I'm going to put the zookas in behind them, and I'm going to tell them to go for that sniper tower there. And then hopefully the heavies will take mo brunt of most of the damage, and these zookas should just absolutely wreck. Let's get a bit closer. Yep, there you go. As you can see, boom. Nice and easy. Right, now everyone on, as you can see, they do stand back a little bit as well. So they do stand away from uh, things, which means that they can be good for getting out of the way of like mortars and stuff like that, because they stand a lot further away from something than the, uh, the heavies do. But there you go, that is destroyed nice and easily, and we've got another life fragment as well, so we're very happy at that. Let's return, we'll do one more quick battle with another low level, and uh, then we'll go ahead and wait for the gunboat to upgrade and... Uh, or shall we? I might just go straight into the uh, resource base. No, not yet, not yet. Don't want to get too far ahead of ourselves. So, let's scout this out and have a look. So there's a load of barrels. Again, it's just uh, machine gun and mortar. So uh, let's go ahead and attack and we should be able to rip through these pretty easily. So, uh, let's take the machine gun down first, I think. And then we'll just go straight in with the heavy. And uh, we'll get the zookas in behind. And hopefully this mortar will just concentrate its fire on the heavies. And uh, because the uh, because the Zookas have stood back a little bit, it shouldn't get them at all. And uh, while we're taking all these barrels on as well, we, uh, we can just get a bit more gun energy. And uh, hopefully the mortar shouldn't really touch us. The heavy's going to take him down on himself, I think. Yep, yeah, there you go. No need for any more barrels then, guys. Straight for the, uh, the base. And uh, that's two really easy uh, kills. And look at that, now the Zookas are on it. They're just getting absolutely smashed. Brilliant. Done. Just like that. Just like that. Ba ba Zookas, off we go. Nice, no casualties. Bit more wood, bit more money. Now we've got more money as well. And I've just spent a load of my money on uh, chopping down trees, actually. I could probably do with uh, keeping my troops trained in the armory, but... Uh, I think I need to upgrade the armory first, I do. So uh, that's again something we can do at some point. But for now, I'm just going to wait it out, get this uh, gumbo up to the next level, and then we'll come back and we'll probably finish on uh, a resource base slaying, uh, as well as doing a few more little improvements uh, at the beginning of the next episode for a few more upgrades. Uh, we've got a sniper tower to upgrade as well, to get to level 5 like these guys. Trying to keep on top of levelling up as well, not doing too many battles, because we're on 34 victory points now. And uh, if by the time when we get up to 40, that will see a new wave of people that could spawn in uh, like these guys here. And uh, I think it's going to be a long time before we ever see that guy again. In fact, I'm probably just going to find a new opponent because that is ridiculous. We'll never take him down. Let's have a look what this guy's at at level 7 then. Yes, he's got a nice, uh, nice base started here. Um, except he's going to leave himself quite quite vulnerable at the back here I mean there's only that one sniper tower really well that one's just caught but if you get your zookas behind there then uh, take that tower down then he's got no defences really nothing can get him so uh, that might be a tactic we'll have to employ at some point as well but uh, yeah for now anyway I'm going to wait for the gunboat to finish itself and uh, then we'll come back and hopefully get ourselves our second resource base so I'll see you guys in a second Okay, very quickly before we go for that resource base, I just want to show you a couple of clips of me uh, upgrading a few items. Didn't get a massive amount done, but uh, managed to get this brand new sniper tower up from uh, level 1 to about level 5, uh, which I really wanted to do. We also managed to get the armory upgraded to level 2 as well, uh, which is good because then we could spend the money on upgrading the troops and keep them stronger. So here's the sniper tower going up to level 4. I also believe I got two residences uh, up another level as well, so that'll give us a, a few more little pits and bobs of gold but uh, got enough money here in this clip to uh, upgrade the Zookas so make them a bit stronger which will be really handy when fighting uh, fighting bosses but oh, 
so far in bases, but their health is so low it's unreal. I uh, need to keep them out of the way of things. But uh, there's another residence upgrade, and then finally the sniper tower upgrade. So there are upgrades, so back for the final battle now. Right, so there's all the upgrades complete for uh, for today's episode. Uh, I was hoping to get a bit more, but we really do need to uh, to get a bit more wood together and things like that. So uh, I think we're going to do some more upgrades at the beginning of the next episode. I uh, can do a few things now, but I've just noticed I want to upgrade my heavies before I do anything. Uh, and that's going to cost 21,000. I've only got 19. So uh, I need a few coins, and uh, uh, the best thing to do, I think, is just go over here. And uh, this guy looks really really easy why have you only got one sniper tower up I do not understand but uh, it's not going to do you too well my friend because uh, I'm going to come in with my heavies and uh, my zookas and uh, we're going to uh, absolutely rip it I mean this sniper tower is probably not even going to get a chance no it's not there you go straight to that then no don't take that down there's nothing else going to attack you take the base down and that's an easy 17 coins or whatever it is uh, sorry 1700 coins or Something like that. Why is that girl taking down that? Well, fair enough. Just make, just, right, okay. Everyone on that. We've got a rogue Zooka, but leave her to it. She's not gonna get a chance to do much more. There we go, nice and easy. So, I wanna get that resource base up and running. Oh, got another life fragment, that's good. Okay, there's another free village. So, it's resource base time, but before I do that, I'm going to create, oh we can create a statue, okay, let's create an idol then, please be wood, I like wood, it's got to be wood at the minute surely, I've got no stone or iron, wood production, plus 7%, that would be nice, something like that, gold production, fine, we'll have it for now, but uh, we don't need it really, so I still need a few more coins, <laughs> um, to upgrade, I can upgrade soldiers, but I don't want to at the minute. Um, right, let's just take on this resource base. Let's try it. Let's try it. Why not? We might get wrecked again, but uh, I'm going to go for it. So, let's attack. Send the heavy out here. And then we'll send the zookas out here. We'll try and get that thing down as quickly as possible. It's not going to be easy, though. As long as it stays on them guys though, it shouldn't matter too much. Oh god, we're going to get a heavy down here. I don't know whether to save him or not. Come on, give me that. Oh god, no, it's taking the Zookas out. We are screwed here. That's it, go for the heavy. Quick. Oh, we've got to be quick here. Come on, it's not doing much that heavy. If them Zookas can just stay at it quickly, then we are all right. But at the minute, heavy's down, we're screwed. Wow. No, doesn't look like I can do that at the minute then. I can't believe how hard it is to take this resource base down. Right, uh, well, we're going to have to do some more grading and uh, then come back, see what we can do. Right, new plan now. We are going to be ending this episode off very soon, but uh, I really, really want to take on that resource base and destroy it. So, things that are lacking. First, as you can see here, we've got a landing craft of level 4. There's only 8 troop capacity on there. How big are the, uh, the Zookas? They're 4. Or are they? Info. They're 2. So, at level 4, we're about right. So that doesn't matter for now. So what we need to do is upgrade the gumbo, but also upgrade the heavies and the missile. If we can upgrade the missile, we should be able to shoot that thing down a bit more. So we need 20,000 coins, and I want to do that right now. And then, uh, yeah, we should be good. So I'm going to start off with barrage. We're going to get 20,000 coins. Oh, God. Right, we've got a level 1 launcher here. Let's attack it anyway. Let's see how much we damage we can do to it just by firing missiles. Right, so, we, yeah, we're going to need a lot more. So, we'll get the heavy down. We'll get the zookas down straight after it. And then, hopefully, it won't touch the zookas. Don't touch the zookas. See, it's not too powerful there, really. But it was doing a lot of damage. Oh, God. 
Okay, so yeah, if you get too close to that thing. Ah, uh, why didn't I send the heavies out? No, it's still got the Zookas there, wouldn't it? Would have still got the Zookas. So we're having real trouble with these rocket launches at the minute. And I'm going to have to wait another 16 minutes to replace my bloody Zooka. So I think I'm going to end the episode in a minute. But hopefully we'll get enough. And what I'm going to do at the start of the next episode is upgrade. Yeah, and that's going to take an absolute age to take this thing down. I might even retreat this or... Uh, just see if they can do it. Can these guys take that down in three minutes? I can't believe it just wiped our Zookas out in one shot. That is ridiculous. Well, I'm going to wait it out anyway, guys, and then I'll see you at the end. Oh yes, they've done it. The mighty duo have done it, just about. We've got 50 seconds left, but thank God for that. I thought they was uh, gonna fail at home really badly. They're really crap for attacking, but it took absolutely ages. But that is down, and uh, thank God it is down. But the trouble is now, all of our uh, Zookas have been wiped out, so that means we've got to spend money on replacing them. And spending money on replacing them means that I can't upgrade the gumbo. So, I'm going to end this episode now, and what I'm going to do is uh, make sure I upgrade the heavies, upgrade the zoo, um, the missile, and then uh, do a few upgrades at the beginning of the next episode on the uh, on the gumbo, and then we should be good to take that resource base down. I can't believe how long it's taken us. Look at that, another 2,000 coins completely gone, just like that. 16 minutes to wait, but who cares? So let's start off with upgrading the gumbo, and I'm pretty sure I might... Um, See how much, see, oh, 18,000 wood to get it to the next level. And I'm going to need two levels to get two more Zookas. So we're going to have to leave it there for now. Let's upgrade what we've got. And, uh, yeah, another two energy will probably be good. So we're going to spend them 10,000 coins right now. So, uh, yeah, let's go ahead and do that. We'll upgrade that. And then, like I said, we'll, uh, we'll save up our coins, get ourselves an upgrade on the heavies, an upgrade on the missile. And then I'm pretty sure that that resource base is going to be a rip. It's just that bloody thing there that's stopping us and then look at all them trees we can harvest up brilliant but uh, yeah for now anyway thanks for watching everyone and i'll see you guys in the next episode